going on everyone? Today we're back for another video. And today is an exciting video because I'm introducing the new daily driver to the channel. Here's a new daily driver, guys. So this is a 2009 Subaru Impreza. It is non-turbo. It's also automatic. Like I said, daily driver. Um, I do have, obviously you see I have a sub for it, an amp and a capacitor. I do have a wiring kit. I have a whole bunch of LED lights that came out of the Impala. I'm gonna see what I can use on it. You know, upgrade a couple things here and there. Um, the car is honestly pretty clean. It's not too bad. Uh, the bumpers are a little bit messed up, but th this build is going to be strictly cosmetics. I'm not doing anything for performance on this thing. So, um, yeah, so it should be a quick build. But as you can see, you know, everything is nice and clean. It's definitely not bad. Probably clean it up a little bit, but we definitely need a radio, though, because uh, I'm not going to be able to use my sub right away. But I want to get all the wires ran and everything. And, um, yeah. So this car actually has a pretty much brand new motor in it. Um, this was a car that was a customer from my job. And the car came in for maintenance a lot and everything. And uh, they blew it up. My boss actually bought this car off of them. Everything works in this. The AC, every, everything works. It literally needs nothing. Um, it does have a slight noise in the rear which I'm gonna go through and try to figure out something with the suspension. Um, but I wanna do coilovers on this anyway, so yeah. Hopefully it's a shock. So everything's here, obviously. This is this motor has, I think, about 30,000 miles on it, maybe a little bit more. It's a very, very low mileage motor. The transmissions, the original trans and everything else, obviously. But this was a good idea for me to do because I don't have car payments with something like this. and. It's just a lot better for me. Um, I actually did brakes all around on this car when my boss uh, first got it. So those are already done. Brake life is great on it. It has four brand new tires. Um, the rear hatch has a new button, a button and latch installed because that stopped working on him. Um, it does already have a remote start, which is great because I live in New Jersey. It does get cold, um, but yeah, so. You know, I got it for a good price, so I'm definitely not arguing with that. And I did a lot of the work on this car, you know, for my boss owning it and him just, you know, giving it to us and saying, I need an oil change or I need this or I need that. So I am very familiar with this car. I know what was done, what wasn't done. This uh, radiator is also brand new. So there is a lot of, you know, good new stuff on this thing. Obviously it does need to be cleaned up. You know, the headlights are hazy, which I will clean, I did the Impalos, but I'll do. I'll worry about that later. I'm not concerned about that right this minute. I also want sequential headlights for it and sequential tail lights. So these aren't gonna stay, but I mean, for the time being, definitely clean them up, see what we could do with those. Uh, like I said, the only like cosmetic stuff wrong, this bumper's obviously screwed up. I wanna do a WRX bumper, so it's not a big deal. There's also a dent down here on the rocker not a big deal either do wrx side skirts or something and then obviously i showed you guys the back bumper so let me switch to the front camera and i'll go over with you guys a little bit more hey guys so as you can see the car is completely bone stock besides a remote start um honestly it's a pretty good looking car it's definitely a lot better looking than my impala i know you guys are new to the channel you haven't seen my impala i blew it up last year the end of last year uh chucked i think it was cylinder six decided to say goodbye car still ran just knocked like a mother and yeah so this is definitely a new project to the channel right here so if you're new to the channel i'll go over with you all three of my vehicles that i do own um but since we did buy this instead of buying a brand new car I am going to be looking for a 99 to 04 Mustang. It's probably going to be a V6 at first because I just need the body. I want to do a bunch of stuff to that, a Coyote and, you know, but we'll talk about that when I actually pick one up. I don't want to jump too far ahead here, 
But um, yeah, so I know there's a lot of new new people to the channel, and I just want to say thank you for the support that you guys give me. Um, you know, you guys are great for watching the videos and everything. And you know, I know I'm a smaller channel, but you know, as stuff progresses, channel will get better. So yeah, so I got this right here. This is gonna be Project Scooby. And then if you guys don't know the Jeep, the Jeep is no longer a daily driver, thank God. That's my 2001 Jeep Grand Cherokee. Um, it has a bunch of work done to it. Definitely go over, check my videos out. Um, I do a lot of how-to videos on that thing. Like I've owned that Jeep for a very, very, very long time. <clears throat> but now that we have this, the Jeep is gonna be getting a lot more love. Um, I do wanna get this all situated first before I do start working on the Jeep again. So just bear with me in the next couple of videos. They're gonna be Subaru content. I know a lot of you are Jeep guys, but hey, it's all wheel drive. So at least we got something in common, right? <laughs> so, but yeah, with it being all wheel, no longer do we have to destroy the Jeep with the snow and the salt and all that nasty crud that New Jersey puts on the roads. So that'll be pretty fun. And then my last project that I have, I don't do too much with this just because there's nothing really wrong with it, but this is my 2003 Yamaha Blaster. Um, that's Project Blasto. And then obviously I told you guys this is Project Scooby and the Jeep is actually Project Frankenstein. I know I never, um, you know, referred to it as that, but that is its name. That is what I named it. Um, it has that name for good reason. I'm pretty sure I said why in one of my older videos. So definitely go check out my other videos. But today, I just wanted to introduce the daily. It's gonna be a short video, nothing crazy. And then uh, next week will be a video of me working on this, which I'm actually gonna get started on today. So it'll be the same day. So you'll see me looking the same, but I wanna split it into two different videos just because I've been a little bit busy lately. You know, my puppy that I just picked up and um, I've been working a lot. So um, yeah, so I need content. So I'm gonna split it up, but thank you guys for watching. Definitely like, comment, subscribe. Plenty more content to come with all three of my projects and future projects. You know, I'm always looking to buy stuff. So till next time, catch you in the next one. Peace. What's up, baby? Huh? What's up, Buster? What are you doing? You chewing on that stick? <laughs>